Hello and welcome to yet another Views from the Veranda on a glorious day in the Shire. It finally feels like summer has arrived. So what I want to share with you today is my views on the downside of um, selling off market. That is to say that not on the property portals or putting some advertising funds across your property. Um, there was some research done by a very large group called PropTrack um, that analysed uh, property sales across Australia uh, over 2020 and 2021 and they identified the fact that those properties which were sold off market achieved significantly lower prices than those on average that sold um, on market. So yes, as a vendor you might be thinking to save money or life could be easier, but in fact you could be losing tens of thousands of dollars by not going on the market. And as I said, if I talk about on the market, that's putting some advertising funds against the property and mainly putting them on the main real estate portals such as realestate.com and Domain. So looking at the specific stats, um, over 20 and 21 uh, in property sales, what they found is that off-market sales achieved 2.6% less on average than on-market sales. You could look at uh, New South Wales, Victoria and the ACT and they were affected the most. Um, on average, that equated to over $30,000 in a difference in sale price, while the cost of advertising might be anywhere on average between $4,000 to $8,000. So in addition to that, if you're in the lower medium price range, um, the percentage becomes a little bit higher, about 3.6%. So what you're finding that the average loss from selling a property is significantly different to the cost of actually advertising. So in deciding to sell, you know, I can understand how a vendor might think to save money, uh, but the costs far outweigh, um, uh, the costs of actually running advertising far outweigh what you can achieve in the sale price. Um, as agents, we often come across uh, uh, owners which have actually signed up with other agents because they've enticed them with the ability to say that we're going to sell it off market, we're going to use our database. Well, look, if you want to achieve the best possible price for your property, you have to get competition. And the only way to get competition is to expose your property to as many buyers as possible. And that's essentially through the main property portals. Uh, one way of looking at it is an off market sale is often the highest price that an owner will accept, while an on market sale is the highest price that the market will pay. And in most cases, that'll be more. So look, if you'd like to know more about selling your price, your house for the highest possible price, contact us, message us. We're here to give you the best advice the Shire can provide. But until next time, take care and look after each other. Thank you.